I'm joined by someone very special in the studio. Talked to him before, but he's never been like right here. Welcome back to Malaysia, <laughs> Caleb Scott. <laughs> I've never been right in person, right? Right here in this studio. In this studio. Yeah, it's good to be here. Thank you so much for having me. Always a pleasure. And I mean, you've been to Malaysia so many times. I feel it's like my third visit to KL. But I'm so happy to be back. Obviously, as well, from like COVID times, you have a deeper appreciation of travel now. So like, mm. I'm just so happy to be back, especially in the Lunar New Year as well. And what's really amazing about that is it's the year of the dragon, right? Yeah. And my sign is a dragon because I was born ah. in So I'm just saying it's my year. So did you get to <laughs> celebrate anything like Chinese New Year while you were here? Yeah, we did some like we went to, I think when we was in Singapore, we went to the gardens and we mm-hmm. saw the light show and there were like different things. Like when we were in Marble 8 the other day having dinner, uh-huh. um, they had a dragon that came around and they ah. peeled the fruits and yeah, it was really cool. Do you have that kind of experience before? Like, have you seen no, never. lion dance? Never, never, never before. I so I was so dances. happy to be here during the Lunar New Year and my my year of the dragon as well i feel like you're one of the celebrities that i see who comes to malaysia and actually spends a few days here like yeah. you always seem to go around music has brought me here and i'm mm-hmm. so appreciative of that and you know i'm here to perform i'm here to open for ed Sheeran, and i'm here to talk to you guys about my music and stuff but then also it would be a shame to come all this way and not do not get involved with all the like local food and with local people and spend some time like traveling and like i went to batu caves and we're right by the twin towers and stuff so it's just cool to go out and immerse yourself in the culture you know i just think i'm so far from home it's something i would have dreamed of doing before Mm -hmm. so i'm just making the use of my time so since you've been around a few times is there something like a favorite thing that you look forward to when you know you're coming back to malaysia i mean apart from being here it hits i love the people i love the food i mean i love food same (laughs) maybe a bit too much that's why i'm down the gym every day <laughs> but like whilst I've been here, so I have fallen in love with Onde Onde. Ooh, delicious. Nice. Okay. A quay, I think it's called. Yeah. Kwe. I love Tehalia. It's my new favourite drink. Okay. You know the pulled tea, the ginger tea. Uh-huh. Delicious. Pandan. Love that. I've just fallen in love again, all over again with Malaysia. So just like true Malaysians, when you leave, you miss the food. A hundred percent. I'm gonna be back home eating my mum's Sunday roast, being like, oh, I wish I was having like some nasi goreng. Well, Sunday roast is pretty good, you know. <laughs> yeah, Sunday roast. You can't go wrong especially mum's cooking as well i miss that so much